I enjoy visiting Vegas because it's a small town, or it's probably bigger than some of the small towns I've been visiting, but I love visiting, you know, the sort of small community type places, friendly folks, and I find Vegas is like that, you know. It's, it's you know, having known Jim Turr here for several years and other people, you can, you can come into the town, you can make yourself feel at home here. There's a, there's a homely sort of atmosphere, like that Charlie's Bakeries we eat at, you know, it's nice and friendly. Because I love taking photographs and walking around. And there's so many interesting looking buildings here, you know. In both East and West Las Vegas, I discovered there's actually two communities as such now together. But you know, go around Plaza, the Plaza Hotel, that area. There's some beautiful looking jobs. So there's a lot of old cars here. Is there any particular reason why there should be a look? Uh, because the Humidity is low. The old cars don't rust out like they do in the east. Oh, yeah, Did you know that? It. But these, well, the old cars I've seen look like spotless models. You know, real vintage cars kept immaculately clean. Yeah, or restored. Yeah. Yeah. I worked in in Nashville, so I used to go to Nashville a lot. But also, uh, I did work out of Austin. So, and I built up a lot of contacts around Texas. You know, Austin, Fort Worth. San Antonio, Brady, Lubbock. So I, in some ways I prefer coming to Texas because I can spread around and see a lot more people. If I go to t Nashville, and I, I do know a lot of people in Nashville, it's only really Nashville I go to. And that's changed so much. It was a nice small little town when I first went. And now all the historic buildings seem to be knocked down. And they're just building skyscrapers now. And it's like any any other big city, as far as I'm concerned. It's lost the, the sentiment of what it was. The music's not as bad. Well, that's one of the reasons I, I've sort of retired in recent years. To me, country music has lost the country aspect. It's, it's a hybrid of pop and rock. It's morphed into that. Yeah, uh, traveling, I was coming to uh, Las Vegas D from Clovis, but I did a detour up to, to Roy. You know, because as a Bob, great Bob Wills fan, I discovered that's where he first started. He was a barber in, in, um, in Roy before he started his music career, moving off to, to Texas. And Roy is a great little town, and they had a mural of him on the wall. So I was glad to do that little detour. Yesterday. But they don't really promote it, strangely enough. No, it's amazing because, um, it, it, well, there's nothing really to promote, I guess. <laughs> I don't know if a barber shop is still there, but they have this uh, wall mural. And that's about the only only relic of Bob Wills there. So, Mascara is a very interesting town because it's another little old one street town almost, but every building was freshly painted, which and every everybody looked different. The, the thing I have learned, well, but going there, I was warned in advance, make sure you keep your gas, your car full of gas, because from Hogan up to Roy was about 100 miles, there was no gas stations. Even Mascaro has, didn't have a station. So, so I was lucky in Roy had a very small gas station. Well, we appreciate that you visit Las Vegas and that you like it. It's a pleasure, it's lovely to be here.